This video is regarding nil potent matrix. Any square matrix, according to the definition of nil potent matrix, any square matrix A is called nil potent if a power m equal to 0 where this 0 is a null matrix we, we can take an example of such a matrix let's suppose that we have a equal to 2 minus 2 2 minus 2 now I will square this matrix if I find a square I will just multiply this matrix with itself Now how we multiply two matrices? So we go like that. First row, first column. So it's equal to 2 times 2 is 4. And minus 2 times 2 is minus 4. So it becomes the very first element of the resultant matrix. And then first row, second column. 2 times minus 2 is minus 4. And minus 2 times minus 2 is plus 4. And again, two, second row, first column. 2 times 2, 4. Minus 2 times 2 is minus 4 and second row second column 2 times minus 2 is minus 4 and minus 2 times minus 2 is plus 4 here and we get here 4 minus 4 is 0 minus 4 plus 4 is also 0 and we also get 0 here 0 here we get 2 cross 2 as a resultant matrix and it's an null matrix therefore we can say that A is nil potent according to the example that we considered because a square is equal to 0 and this 2 is an integer and according to the definition we we any any square matrix a is nilpotent if a raised to power m is equal to 0 where m is any integer so this m may or may not be equal to 2 but according to the example that we considered a square comes out equal to 0. So we have this matrix A nil potent. So in the next video, I'll be covering what is involutory matrix and idempotent matrix. Okay, see you guys.